It is a little after five on the day before Election Day, and that means good and bad news about absentee ballots. Yeah, so the good news is if your ballot's in, it'll be counted tomorrow. The bad news is if it's not in yet, you have to go to the polls if you want to cast your vote. And Danny Monteverdi reports work is underway right now across the state to make sure that the tens of thousands of ballots already mailed in are counted as quickly as possible tomorrow. The New Orleans City Council Chamber looked more like a mailroom on Monday. Dozens of workers checked thousands of absentee ballots to make sure they are ready to be counted Tuesday. It's a scene that played out in every parish across the state ahead of the big day. Are we overwhelmed? Yes, but we're doing our jobs the best we can, and uh, we're really very pleased that voters are paying attention to the election, hopefully all elections. Even more absentee ballots waited in Orleans Parish Registrar Sandra Wilson's office down the hall from the council chamber. You know, you can't even see the furniture in the office. Nearly one million people have already voted in Louisiana. In Orleans Parish alone, just more than 21,000 people requested absentee ballots. As of Saturday, just fewer than 13,000 had mailed them in or dropped them off before the deadline of 4.30 p.m. Monday. Many people stopped by City Hall to hand in their ballots from their cars or to give them to registrar employees at a curbside drop-off location while they still could. Inside the council chambers, Orleans Parish Clerk of Criminal Court Arthur Morell watched the verification process, which this year began four days before Election Day. This is one process that really holds it up. The goal is to make sure every ballot is properly filled out. A process Morrell hopes will make counting the exponentially large number go fast. We should have everything counted by at least 11 o'clock tomorrow. It may be before, but we anticipate it at 11 o'clock p.m. For voters whose absentee ballots didn't make it to their local registrar's office by the 4.30 p.m. deadline, you can still vote at your polling place on Election Day. Danny Monteverdi, Eyewitness News. And election officials across the state will begin to count absentee ballots at 10 a.m. tomorrow. You should call your local registrar's office to see if they received your ballot if you're not certain. Anyone in the military living overseas or who is in the hospital has until 8 p.m. tomorrow to get their absentee ballots into the registrar's office to be counted.